Hi everyone, welcome to Imaging Study. Today we are going to see a case of incomplete abortion or written products of conception. A young married female patient came with amenorrhea for more than two months. She had complained for parvaginal bleeding and severe lower abdominal pain for one day. She also gave the history of using abortifacient drugs. Let's see what we have got on ultrasound. Here you can see the longitudinal section of the uterus showing a distorted irregular gestational sac at the lower uterine cavity. It should be situated at the upper part of the body. And on transverse section, you can also see this irregularity of the sac and its low position. You can see internal echoes, but there is no embryo or yolk sac. Here is the body and the fundal region, but the sac lies at the lower uterine cavity. So an irregular gestational sac at the lower uterine cavity without any fetal pole or yolk sac with the history of parvaginal bleeding suggests it as a case of incomplete abortion. Here is the longitudinal section and you can see this irregular gestational sac with internal echoes but no yolk sac or embryo. And this is the transverse section. You still can see this irregularity. So in summary, an irregular distorted gestational sac is noted within the lower uterine cavity without any yolk sac or embryo, suggesting it as a case of incomplete abortion. Now the take-home message. In confusing cases, both longitudinal and transverse sections will help understand irregularity of the sac and confirm retained products of conception. Thank you for watching this video. Subscribe to our YouTube channel for more. See you on the next one. Have a nice day.